kitchen is considered the most expensive per square foot room in a in the home. Obviously, mm -hmm. that has to do with appliances and stuff. But the countertops and cabinets are uh, a big part of that. What do you feel that people are hesitant about the idea of using stone on countertops? I think they used to be a lot more hesitant about it. Uh, but with the quartz and stone products becoming so popular, uh, I find that most people are interested in those services for their kitchen. And it's really worth the investment because with the return on investment's great if you're planning to sell really soon. But if you're planning on living in the house and actually using the countertop surfaces, you're going to want something that's a high quality and, and nearly, I wouldn't say indestructible, but I would say pretty tough surface to, to damage. So most people prefer that. Also, we used to compete with like, um, tile for countertops or laminate. Laminate people still might want to go with, but the tile nowadays you can find quartz or granite options that are pretty inexpensive. So it gets a little more competitive with that. Oh, well, good. So if the, what are your, you know, with quartz, what are your variety of colors and stuff that you can work with? Well, the fun thing about quartz is you can use with, with natural stone, you're kind of stuck with a certain pattern or style for granite. Um, mm -hmm. Quartz I think is fairly popular, but the look of quartz, you can mimic just about anything. So the really hot item has been marble countertops or the white marble look. Mm -hmm. And most people don't want to use marble in their kitchens because it stains and it etches and there are all sorts of problems. So with quartz, you're able to copy that look and get the marble look in your kitchen with the qualities of quartz. The other thing they do that's been really popular lately is the darker looks and the concrete look. So you can have concrete look countertops without the concrete <laughs> on there and sense of that. Well, it wouldn't be nearly as porous, I wouldn't think as, you know, because most people don't know that concrete, how porous it really is. It is. Yeah. And a lot of maintenance. So you're